All right, so it is Wednesday, December the 5th at 4.48 p.m. Here we go, QuickTime has not been used in two days. I have not used QuickTime in two, in two days, and immediately it spikes to 292.9300. No visible Wi-Fi here. Doesn't mean I do not have a network connection, but it didn't take long. So this is what it looked like a few moments ago this is at 4.46.50 so just a couple of minutes ago quick time was showing here but it was not in the dock now it shows up in the dock and then it disappears from the dock okay it disappears on its own anyway so it's not in the dock but it was showing here okay in activity monitor so just to document within a couple of minutes it's, it spikes okay it does not take long all right what do I want to document let me start from this corner here we are this is uh, allow Bluetooth devices to wake this computer has been grayed out Okay, that is grayed out. That should not be. This is a setting I have from the factory reset. I don't know if that's normal or not, but that's what I have. Screenshots keep covering this thing up, but anyways, I cannot log out past five minutes. It doesn't go below, not past, but below five minutes. And I can do that right now. So security, privacy and security, go to privacy. Hmm. The ge uh, general. Have to find it again. And anyways, It is privacy and security right here. And I'm, oh, 3, 313, look at that. Anyways, it could not go below five minutes. I don't know if that's normal or not. So this is the, hold on. Privacy and security, privacy, this is the one. Unlock. Unlock. Advanced. There we go, five minutes. And it will not go below five minutes. It will go above six, above five, but it will not go below five. Don't know why. Maybe it's normal, but I'm documenting it. So, what I've already documented many, many times is there's a remote. Now, this has changed. I've never seen iCloud Drive here. I've seen shared location what is it um shared devices i've seen here and apple already have the screenshots of it shared devices and remote disk has always been part of shared devices only now i still have remote disk but it's under the category of locations okay so that's a big change now i have turned siri off Siri actually came enabled on this computer it came enabled I turned it off here but over here it says the app has used my location within the last 24 hours but I've turned it off uh, more than 24 hours ago don't know why that is but I'll keep track of that um, right system preference goes up to 13 I've seen activity activity monitor goes up to 30 okay and all of them the general uh, finder and everything else they've gone up to 30 okay but I, I wasn't able to get a screenshot and that is problematic here's the finder that's at 27 uh, here finder is at 27 
Okay, I tried to take a screenshot, but I got this uh, here. But it was at 27 when I saw it. Um, the mic. Oh, look at that, 330. The mic, I had to lower it. I've learned how to undo this internal microphone that will listen to every sound in the environment. Okay, so those are done, except for this one here. Here's energy impact. So I haven't been using, as I said, I have not been using QuickTime. So let me go through these screenshots. This is yesterday, December the 4th. So I have not been using QuickTime for more than 24 hours. So that should not spike the way it did. So here I am emailing Apple and and uh, Safari is 1.1. Okay, I'm, I'm constructing an email 1.1, that's Safari. Then it goes to 77.6. And you can see the timeline. This is 1038. 1038. It's at 1.1. 1038. It's at 76.6. Same email. Ten thirty eight. One point four. 1039, 68.6, 1039, 3.4, 1040, 94, 1040, 8.8, 1040, 209, same email. Uh, this email was already constructed via notes. I was just cut and paste and I was reading it. So it's, it went to 209, so that was at 1040. 1040, 209.4. 1040, 209.4, Safari. 1040, 27.3, 1040, 1.0. So if I'm in Safari, if I'm in Safari and it's 1.0 impact, why in the world would it go to 27 here in Finder? It doesn't make sense, does it? So, and the last one, I have many of them, but I just decided to do these ones. And so here it is, 1041, and I wanted to click on the, I'm trying to take a screenshot. Unfortunately, my uh, um, cursor was at the bottom and this came up, but here it is, 1041, and I have an energy impact of 249.7 for Safari. Okay, from 1 to 249.7. All right, and so this is quick time, and this is escalating. So when I started, when I started this, before I started this recording, energy impact for quick time was 5.29. It's 39.42. And remember, I have not used quick time. This one here, quick time doesn't even make the list here. Okay. So. Okay, so I'm going to close that one, and this is just another screenshot. 184. Safari is 184, and this is me emailing um, Apple again, and this is today. All right, December the 5th. That's today. So whenever I email Apple, escalation, I see escalation in, in temperature, in uh, energy impact. So... What next? So these are done. Now, when the computer started, the f uh, when after the reset, this is what happened in system preference. The remote login, there's the uh, Mojave is being downloaded. Login window, set administrators.
remote management, said administrators. While sharing now, it used to be that I used to see on the users and groups, there was always a new group that has stopped. What I see now is under file sharing, there's a new group, a public folder, sorry. And in the old, the previous to now, it used to be a public folder and everyone was ticked off. It's all been documented. Now it's under file sharing and it's a public folder. Okay. And here is screen sharing. And screen sharing has administrators on it. Okay. I'm sure all of the those should not be, especially this one here. Wake up the computer. Uh, allow Bluetooth devices to wake up this computer. Actually, all of them were ticked off. I undid that one. I undid that one, but the computer would not allow me to undo that one. So let me move over here. What do I have here? I have not this one. I'll get back to this one right here. 3.12 minutes into this recording, I see that my computer is connected to Cyber 5G on Monday. Today is Wednesday. This is the day of the reset. Okay, computer is connected at 3.12 minutes in. This is the recording. 312 minutes in. 310, and it keeps, it connects, but then it tells me invalid password. There we go. There, it's on. There, it's on. See? See that? And then it just connects. And right? then it tells me invalid password. See that? So, let's play that again. There. It's on. See that? And then it just connects. Do that again. Nine. On here. There. It's on. There. It's there. on. See that? And then it just connects. Okay. That's the magic of that recording. All right. What's quick time doing? Quick time is three twenty seven. Okay. So the computer connected to my network, then disconnected and told me that my password is invalid. Okay, here, invalid password. And right now the computer is extremely hot, very hot. All right, and this is a first recording that showed, this is Mojave downloading. I've already showed the screenshot. And this is login administrator, file sharing. There's file sharing right there. And it's a public folder. That should not be. Okay, so it's all been recorded. Um, right. And I saw the binoculars when there is no visible Wi Fi connection. Wi Fi does not, when there's no, this does not mean anything. There is remote access. I saw that. Okay, and according to this article, binocular icon, binoculars icon. This pops up only when your computer is being watched. Okay, so there we go. And where's the uh, quick time is 277. Incredibly hot computer. Now I've already documented this. I sent it to Apple. Energy impact to QuickTime from QuickTime is 410. Here's here is preview at 24. Okay close that and this is battery is telling me that QuickTime is using a significant amount of energy so that the Apple it seems to go in one ear and out the next um, so 121 I'm just essentially documenting 390 um, at 9 30 p.m. Quick time is 121.5. And again, 9.30, 9.38 p.m. 9.38 a.m. 
it's 121.5. Nine forty PM and I didn't use it the whole day, it's three ninety. All right. Uh, Safari. I've documented Safari's at seventy seven, but that doesn't matter because I've seen it go up to what two hundred two hundred and forty nine point seven. All right, so these are testing the first day. Second day, yesterday and today. Um quick time has not been used until now. And so this is what's happening. Um, I've already documented the login, doc documented that. Um, and this is QuickTime at 44.3 in a recording that's 39.32. And then I go up to one hour, one hour of recording, 4.07 gigabyte, and it's at 41.7, okay? energy used. This one here I've documented. Two hours of recording. Two hours of recording using QuickTime. It takes 60% of power in two hours. All right. Um, and this recording, I turned on QuickTime. This is what I saw. This is on Monday, December the 3rd. There's a binoculars at 9.39.20 and this is at 9.39.27 seven seconds after this and this is at 9.39.22 right so 20, 22 two seconds after this I took the screenshot it disappeared and it didn't come back all right, so there's, um, you know, um, cloak and dagger that goes on constantly, cloak and dagger constantly. Um, so I tested at quick, uh, quick time, as I've mentioned, and this is what's happening. The spike should not happen. The immediate spike, and here's the, here's something that's been happening a lot. Actually, let me... Go to applications folder and I go to utilities 312.9 and I go to console. Now, con look, console only shows me now, right now, 17.0615. Now, it will not show me any other logs, it'll only show me the now. Okay. I go to errors and faults, and again, it shows me now. It does not show me anything else. It only shows me the now when it's opened, which is problematic. I go to right here. System log, no. I go to here, and I get this window. This should tell me when I've used my computer, but it's telling me protection merge postponing merge until first XPC message for CPU boost. I have no clue what that is. I've never seen it before. This is new to this reset. This computer will not give me the logs for this computer. I go back here and I close it. And this is new. This is new. I've never seen a drop down um, window that tells me, are you sure you want to close the window streamed log messages will be discarded when this window is closed which means I cannot save my logs I'm gonna take a screenshot of this here there. all right and uh, I usually have console in the window but it disappeared all right and I think that's about it Oh, look at quick time is at 338. Okay, energy impact is 338, and I'm going to stop recording now. And as usual, I go here and I go the end. If it doesn't say the end, something is wrong. The end. All right, stop recording.